a good exercise in meditation is to stop and think of all the people you have to be grateful for, all the help you've received from other people. The simple fact that we're in this monastery. A lot of people gave a lot of things. And beyond that, we have all the people who've passed on the Buddha's teachings, starting with the Buddha himself. Without him, without those people passing it on, we probably wouldn't be here sitting, watching our breath, training the mind. All the people we're indebted to, think of them and then realize the best way to repay that debt is to practice. As the Buddha said, one of the motivations for practicing is realizing that when your, med your mind gets more and more trained, then the people who benefited you will receive benefits from you more and more. So our motivation for practice is not just for us, or not just for our own sake. It's for the sake of everybody who's helped us. So it's good to cast your net wide. Think of all the people you're indebted to. May they be happy. May they understand the causes for true happiness and be willing and able to act on them. When you've expanded your mind like this before you practice, then it's a lot easier to settle down and look at what you've got right here, right now. Otherwise, you just come straight from your narratives of the day. Issues of the day clutter up the mind, and they look really big. But if you take a larger perspective, you can see how small they are. And when you see them as small, then you can get around them. So stop and take some time every day. Think about all the people you're indebted to. May they be happy. May they rejoice in the merit that you've made, if they have any way of knowing about it. And may they benefit from your practice. That way, when you feel inclined to give up on the practice or to cut it short, realizing you're depriving not only yourself but also other people. It's like it should give you the energy to keep with the practice and to go higher and higher. Because it's only with the help of others that we're able to practice. We have to do the practice ourselves, but there's a lot of preparation, a lot of external things, a lot of external conditions that require the help of others. So always keep that in mind.